swear the referee's gonna stop us. He better start to move, and when his opponent starts to posture, he needs to put his feet on the hips, push him away, and try to escape this very, very dangerous position. Oh, and he caught the kick. Pushing forward with strikes, and now goes for the takedown, it's good. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Rivera's got the full mount. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? They continue to exchange. Just over three minutes to go round one. Well placed kick there by Rivera. Stuff the takedown, no problem. He loaded up with that right hand. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, connects with another uppercut, so that's been the weapon of choice, and he went back to it there and lands. Over and over again. Great action. Nice double leg takedown attempt there, and you gotta think that's something that's gonna give him confidence moving forward in this fight. A lot of confidence when it happens that easily. He took a shot, he got a takedown. What now will stop him from doing it over and over? Oh, oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Nice hook. Now goes in and secures the takedown. All right, half guard position here, DC. You have an extra pop in your step when you talk about fighters working out of this half guard. Oh, man. I like half guard as a top fighter. I understand half guard as a bottom fighter. Don't want to be there. It's right. very dangerous. But if you are there, you have to be winning the position of the underhook. It opens up so many opportunities for you to either escape or sweep. Well, the ground and pound strikes to the body keep on coming. You got to start to minimize the damage. Good work here by Rivera. And they both stand up. Big punch from the clinch. 34 total strikes have landed for Jimmy Rivera. Goes to the body with the knee. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Back to the feet. See a lot to like on both sides here. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. Just out of range, though, with it. Stuffs the take down there. How Back to the feet. Oh! Punch coming, it's blocked. All right, so he's landed a few similar uppercuts already, DC. Gotta think he goes back to it. I am almost certain he's gonna go and try to find another one of those. But expect him to really sit down and try to make one really count to try to end this fight. Tries to work it into a takedown. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Wow! And just like that, the fight is over. He's done. He's done. What a performance. Pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent only saw it coming, and before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. So there he is, the undisputed UFC bantamweight champion, and what better way to get the job done tonight?